the office environment for me is something that I'm relatively inexperienced in. So you you try and use the things that like we talked about, the things that made you successful as a as a player. Um, you try to bring them in, into whatever environment you're in, whether it's whether it's an office or it's a training or whatever. So for me, you know, we're, I'm quite lucky that it's quite a small team at at say in terms of the commercial team there's probably only about 20 of us in, in the office. I, I just try to support my my staff. Um, you know, I've got a couple of sales guys, the media guys, and it's it's not about always having the right answers, not not always thinking you know the the answer. You know, you, you've not always got the key to open that magic door to whether it's filling a stadium or bringing a, a new headline sponsor in, but it's Again, it's, it's relationships. Trying to trying to build relationships with the team, with the team around you. Trying to bring out the best. Trying to you know make them feel confident to make decisions. Make them feel confident to go with ideas or, or instincts that they've got. And um, and generally, just trying to bring, bring the best out of them. I think overall, it's it, it's gone relatively well. It's gone smoothly. Obviously, the opportunity that that Jed has given me since he since he bought the club. Um, you know, along with, with Simon and, and Dimes, you know, it, it, the support that the lads give me every every day is, in, is incredible. You know, I'm, I'm learning a lot every day. Uh, you know, and there's not many better blokes out there in business to learn from than than Jed. Um, and, and equally, you know, a lot of the things that that, that I try to do as a, as a player that made me successful as a player, you, you know, you try and just take that over into the commercial world and. Uh, you know, always looking to improve, always, always trying to do better, but uh, at the moment things are going alright.